we have assembled here today at uh, village Ningja Bolchugre under Gambigri block to conduct field day on broccoli and cabbage. This broccoli and cabbage this year we have cultivated using biostimulants which has been provided by Questa Bioorganics Private Limited and in collaboration with Artery Zone 7 Umiyam Barapani and uh, Iser KVK we have taken up this trial uh, in this village Ningja Bolchugre in one of the progressive farmers field Mr. Hamlin CH Marak. The Questa Bioorganics Private Limited, who have supplied us with this biostimulants to be tried in the farmer's field, is actually uh, nothing but uh, a combination of uh, amino acids, nitrogen and 14 different micronutrients. So as the uh, government of Meghalaya is uh, uh, running organic mission, so we advocate most of the organic inputs in the farmer's field. So this bio uh, stimulant is completely organic and its main function to, is to enhance the physiology of the plants. Physiology means the leaf growth enhances, root enhances, which ultimately translates into yield. Once the yield is more, farmers will get more profit. Here, during this trial, we have maintained one control plot as well as treated plot. From the treated plot of broccoli, we have found that each card weighs around 350 to 345 gram compared to control where it's mostly 275 to 300 or maximum 320 grams. On an average, there's an increase of 16 to 17 percent in the growth of broccoli in the treated plot. Also, we have taken up the same trial in cabbage. The head of cabbage in treated plot is also the growth enhanced compared to control, which is around uh, 2.5 to 3 kg in case of um, a treated plot. And in control, we have around 2.2, 2.3 kg uh, per head. Uh, since this is 85 to 90 days crop, so we have uh, taken various um, parameters before uh, selling it in the market. Uh, before, uh, so in the treated plot, the physiology we have changed that there is a very, uh, if not drastic, but there is a huge difference between the control plot and the treated plot. The physiology, the plant uh, leaves, the roots and the card size is uh, visibly uh, bigger than the control plot. Same is the case for cabbage also. So whatever I have apprised you all now, we would like to listen from the progressive farmer, Mr. Hamlin C.H. Marak's word of mouth. Mama, na nangni experience ko unti sa aganbo ya biostimulants chakale na mai rakom manzo. Namni kama, namni jama mai rakom aganbo. Anga ya biostimulants ko chakale unti sa dengthani ko tim. Nikinga Nimna on Giza Bakuti, Sakiza Bakuti, on Tisha Kumia, on Yako Jakalgora, on Tisha Dalbatin King. Our prize by Tic Tac Manzukma, Dalako de Baitake Rongsa Palana, Dalako de An Joros upon upon the Kipalazo. Acha. To Naya Sam actually Unza, Yade Asal Gitaba Kam Kanga, to Ya Aru, my by Ya Makang Sizunubana, Jakalas Kama, or Makang Sizunubana, Jakana de Skingam, Matnamode. To Namaina Aganaska, Dal Chinga, your program field de Dakinga, Nangni Fieldo, Chinga, ya, my ba, Gigamani Ranko, Okamahana, Nina Mangan, Nangni experience ko na, Untisa, convincing way, Bison, Untisa Aganbo, my ya, my Bosu, Aru, my Kena, Jakalaha. Yeah, I share Kibi Kenny, Madame Joyce, and Gopas, Sam Gutabo, Sagatabo, one away. Newman Yakuza Kale, Anga Satinia, Yon Brocolio, Arubanda Kubio, Ya on Titi, Dalbatin Caro, Newman Satkija Barangi, Kumia, Nianga Naka, Newman Mukanchiba, Yan Dakpa. My because my my uncle did the Kalan Kugan.
the main objective of today's program the field day which we have conducted on cabbage and broccoli is to bring awareness among the farming community about the importance of this technology so we have used biostimulants in one of the progressive farmers field now after seeing the result we want to uh, disseminate our experience and the impact of these biostimulants to other farmers of this area as well so you can see i have with me around 15 to 20 uh, if not progressive farmers marginal farmers from this village and they have heard from uh, uh, Hamlin C.H. Marek's mouth about the uh, efficacy and the impact of these biostimulants. So, uh, during this field day, our main purpose is to take this technology to other farmers' fields. So, that's why we have called them and we would like to hear from them whether they are willing to take up this technology or not in the coming season. So, Mehemia. Na kena hamo ya mama hamli ni experience ko ya biostimulants jakale my lab ko mana ha biaga na de unti sa ding thang nikka ha aro my ba size ba dalso broccoli or banda kopi na song ba ya kena mang na ya sam ko ba asal gitta biostimulants jakalas kama hoy jakalas pa chamba my my crop o jakalas ka na song chunga na onde broccoli o jakal gan aro banda o jakal gan acha. ना <laughs> 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 very good. So, all of you heard about uh, the farmer's reaction about this biostimulants. So, this is our first year trial. Uh, we would like to carry this trial in this coming season also to see the further impact of this biostimulants in various crops, especially. Um, cabbage and uh, broccoli so i would like to show you the size of the broccoli which we received from uh, by using biostimulants so this kind of size card weighs around uh, 325 to 350 gram and uh, uh, the vigorous growth and the greenness and the roots also you can see uh, it has uh, really uh, the spread is uh, very high and uh, the entire crop looks very uh, healthy vigorous so the main purpose of using this biostimulants is to enhance uh, the growth of this uh, plant so that once chlorophyll is more synthesis will be more and which will in turn give better yield that is the card and not only the card, the remaining portion of these plants can be fed to the cattle to enhance uh, the milk production. So this is the overall objective. So we have also noticed the infestation of insects and this is a very rare uh, one or two plants we have observed compared to control plots where at least uh, two, three, four plants were the more uh, attacked by uh, various uh, diseases and uh, insects so this is the importance of biostimulants and we have also heard from the farmers about uh, uh, its uh, impact so in the coming season also we would like to further carry out the trial biostimulants how to use it I will just uh, describe in brief first uh, this biostimulant is in liquid form 
it's one liter uh, bottle. So at the time of sowing in the nursery, we have to use 17.5 ml per liter of water. This has to be diluted in one liter of water, taking this 17.5 ml, and it has to be sprayed in the nursery, drenched in the nursery. Again, on the day of transplanting to the main field, we just drench it two, three hours before transplanting in the main field in the evening with again another round of uh, spray that is 17.5 ml per liter of water. So if you know the concentration per liter, you can go for preparing two liters, three liters, four liters as per your requirement. Then after transplanting in the main field on the 30th day again in the evening, we spray this biostimulant at the rate of 20 ml per liter of water. Here in the main field, we have enhanced the quantity by 2.5 ml further. So only one spray is required at 30 days and another spray at 60 days. Thereafter, we don't have to spray this by stimulants, only uh, observe and take the data. This biostimulants is completely organic. It has uh, uh, amino acids, uh, then other micronutrients, um, 14 micronutrients like we have calcium, boron, manganese, magnesium, iron, uh, and uh, etc. So, uh, this uh, biostimulants uh, main purpose is to enhance the growth. So, once the root growth enhances, the plant growth enhances the leaves, so it enhances the photosynthetic activity. Once more photosynthesis are produced, then it gets reflected in the yield. The yield also enhances. So this is the basic use of this biostimulants. Just it enhances the physiology of the plant. We have come to cabbage plot uh, to show you the uh, impact of this uh, using biostimulants. So I have already harvested one cabbage. We can see the physiology of the cabbage is very good. We have around 17 to 18 open leaves and the diameter is around 18 17.5 to 18 centimeter length and breadth wise so uh, and weight already we have taken weight is around 2.75 kg. So, uh, not only this uh, cabbage, we can see here other cabbages which are at the uh, harvesting stage. The size is very good and impressive. So, as uh, uh, I've mentioned uh, in the uh, broccoli plot, that the objectives of this uh, field day is to uh, disseminate the technology to the farmers' field to bring awareness among the farmers about the technologies that we uh, just uh, implement in the farmers' field. So to apprise you all, uh, this uh, cabbage, uh, we have taken up the trial in 200 square meter area. This is a 200 square meter area where we accommodated around 780 to 800 uh, plants, means on an average four cabbages per square meter. And uh, as I said, the size is around 2.5 to 2.75. Uh, elsewhere before also we have uh, seen that uh, sometimes uh, it has gone up to 3 kg also per cabbage. And compared to farmers, uh, uh, I mean control plot, where uh, the size of the cabbage is around 2.2, um, 2.5 uh, uh, kg uh, maximum. So here, uh, the growth you can see it in my hand is very heavy and uh, let's now hear from uh, our progressive farmer in whose uh, plot we have taken up this trial what he feels about this biostimulants on cabbage we biostimulant ko ja khali munai dungthani ko anka so and i want to show to my uh, lady farmers uh, to get convinced so that they can also be given this biostimulant to be used in the coming season to enhance the growth as well as yield. 
নাসং নিব ইয়া সাইজ দে দাল চোক আর মাইবা ইয়া আগ্রে জিমা বা আর নাসং ইয়া মাই রকম ইয়া আসাল জাকালনাস খা আমার বাইশ সময় জাকালে নাসং আগে না মোক ক্যাবেজ বান্ধবী ডাকনাস খা ডাকেন মা নাসং আম তো এস বি অলওয়েজ সে দ্যাট সিং ইজ বিলিভিং সো দ্য ফার্মার্স আর কনভিনসড এন্ড হোপফুলি দে উইল টেক আপ দিস ট্রায়েল ইন দ্য কামিং সিজন and to apprise the farmers the biostimulants uh, will be uh, given a uh, free of cost um, for the initial years um, by questa bioorganics uh, private limited and uh, this uh, trial has been taken up uh, in collaboration with uh, artery zone 7 and kvk uh, west karo hills so uh, with this uh, uh, few words uh, we would like to uh, conclude and send a message to the farming community that it is also possible to grow uh, vegetables and other agricultural crops without using chemical fertilizers like urea mop ssp using bio inputs also the yield can be enhanced and as farmers uh, as government of india is encouraging organic farming natural farming so i think it is possible to boost up the production using bio inputs like we have done using biostimulants but further trial is required in the coming season to further find out the efficacy of this uh, input <music>